Hey guys, hope you're doing great. So today I'm gonna make a French toast. It's very simple to make. Most of the ingredients you already have in your kitchen. This can be a good treat for yourself or for your family, for your partner. Um, yeah, so if you're interested in how I do it, my recipe, then let's get to it. Um, the ingredients and the recipe I'll mention in the description box down below as well as the nutritional value. So yeah, if you're interested, keep watching. Alright, so here are the ingredients which you will need. Uh, six thick slices of white or beef bread, two eggs, two-thirds cup of milk, quarter teaspoon ground cinnamon, quarter teaspoon ground nutmeg, which is optional, one teaspoon vanilla extract, and salt to taste. So all ingredients are here with me, uh, and uh, basically let's start off. Basically, this will only take you 15 minutes and it's going to serve you two to three servings, depends on how much you eat. So yeah, let's get started. First step is to add the milk. And you need two thirds of a cup. Just going to pour it right here. It's around this much, it's almost a full cup. All right, so we're adding that. I already have my fork ready to mix it up. Alright, so we're done with the milk. Then we add two eggs. Some salt can be a sprinkle, just enough. Just to tell you what we have this. And uh, then I add some butter to the pan. I add around two teaspoons of butter to the pan. Uh, just keep a note, I'm not warming the skillet yet. It'll be at, at a later stage. Alright, so I put the butter. Then we add one teaspoon of vanilla extract. Alright. And I usually put cinnamon, but I'm out of cinnamon today, so apologies, but it's in the recipe, you have to add um, cinnamon as well to give that taste um, to your French toast and oomph, you know. So yeah, so here I am with the mixture. I just clean it up, make sure everything is nice and easy. The eggs are... So we're done with the first step. Okay, next step, I heat the, the pan. I already put the tea two, two teaspoons of butter. Just a minute. <laughs> All right, so you can see here it's a medium heat. Swirl it around, just make sure the pan is coated nicely. Alright, so starting to warm up, we're moving on to the third step. Alright, so for the third step, you just take your white or it's called milk bread. I'm using 
milk bread. It can be white or milk bread, it's okay. As long as it's spongy and a bit thick. Uh, basically, I place on the egg and milk mixture, you can see here. Yeah, basically I put on two sides. One side, I soak it. The other side, I soak it. This is how it looks like. And then we can see the pan is already sizzling. With my butter, it's ready. And I just place it here on the pan. So basically, once you put the toast on the pan, it will take a few minutes to get golden on each side. You just flip it on the other side once it's done. And that's it. You repeat for the other side. It's the same thing, the same step. You just soak it in the mixture. You put it on the pan. Yeah, so let me finish all the slices and I'll show you the end result. So you can see here it's becoming more golden in color. Just flip it. Just like that. Just need a few more minutes and it will get done. Also guys, keep in mind to add more uh, butter in the pan as you go along because this two teaspoons of butter is not enough for just the whole toast. It just was enough for one or two toasts, but you need to add butter as you go. It depends. When the pan gets really dry and starts to steam, you add more butter. That's when you know. Alright guys, so this is how the end result is. This is how they look like. I like to add some vanilla ice cream if you noticed here, but you can add other sides, um, you know, some melted chocolate, um, strawberries, whipped cream, maple syrup on the top. It depends what you like, what you have at home, what you prefer. I prefer ice cream. <laughs> I'm such a kid, yeah? <laughs> All right, guys, so I hope you liked and enjoyed this recipe, and I hope you do it for yourself, for your family as well, and see you in the next video. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Bye.